family and friends gathering tonight to remember Sergeant Heidi Rue killed while stationed in Kosovo. Funeral services being held at her hometown of Kiel. NBC 26's Paul Evenson is live in the newsroom tonight with more. Paul? Well, Stacy, for the second time in five years, the community of close to 4,000 is burying one of their own. It's something no community should have to go through once, let alone twice. Whenever she could get vacation time and leave time, she would come here. Here was Keel, Wisconsin, a quiet town split between two counties that twice has had to deal with one of their own killed while serving our country. Amy Kruger was one of 13 victims in a mass shooting at Fort Hood in 2009. Today, the community tries to cope with yet another loss. We were very proud when she, when she joined the service. I spoke with Heidi Rue's stepfather days after the family found out she had been shot and killed while stationed at Camp Bonsteel, the only U.S. military base currently active in Kosovo. The last time she was here, we, we spent Christmas here with the boys and everything. And, and then um, that's when it was confirmed that she did get the volunteer duty and they did say she could go. The 32-year-old mother of two had only been in Kosovo a few short months. Today, as other area veterans stood guard, a full military funeral in her hometown was held so that those who knew her best she's been my little girl forever could say their goodbyes now sergeant rue volunteered to go to kosovo back in february the exact cause and circumstances of her death are still under investigation reporting live in the green bay newsroom paul evenson nbc 26